It's TV Land. Hey. Every time you fix me up with a chick, she turns out to be a dog. And one afternoon, and never said a word. Just killed himself. It's the real thing this time. Sex. I've had a perfectly wonderful evening, but this wasn't it. Watch out, watch out. Hot stop. Coming through. Hot stop. Oh, excuse me, sir. Where's the bathroom? You mean the kitchen, don't you? Oh, yeah. yeah. The kitchen. Where, where is it? right through there. Thanks a lot. Where is the bathroom? For later. It's upstairs. Thanks, man. Uh -huh. I only eat things that swim. You mean fish? No, anything. First I teach it to swim, then I eat it. He spent his bar mitzvah money to buy marijuana? <laughs> Hi there. I'm Buzz Wright, a young executive with EIU. No, you're not. You're the kid from the pizza joint. I saw you come in and go up to the bathroom. <laughs> no, I've been around, but I have never seen a man humiliate himself like that to get into a party. Tell me, why are you here? This is a very big party, right? Lots of important people. People that could do a lot for me. They don't do anything for me. I'm going to level with you. Uh-huh. I'm not an executive with EIU. I'm on candid camera. Actually, I work in the mail room at EIU. Uh -huh. But I'm not going to stay there. No, no, no. I mean it. I've got what it takes. Ambition, drive, a very quick mind. I'm on my way up. You seem pretty high right now, Mr. Pepperoni. You know, I'll never forget when I was a kid back in Wheat Germ, Nebraska. I used to mow lawns, quarter lawn. Another kid was doing it for a dime. We had kind of a grass war going. I said, look, don't be silly. Let's get together. By the time I was 10 years old, I knew all about mergers. That's terrific. And bankruptcy, because he moved to Detroit with all the money. Rotten kid. He mowed goodbye on my lawn. How quaint. But since then, I've learned a great deal about the business. It's not what you know, it's who you know. Give them what they need. And they'll need you. There are more business deals done over a cocktail glass. Than is done over a desk. There are more skeletons in the closet than, than there are, there are, in, are a in a graveyard. Hey. My daddy used to say the same things. Really? Where does he work? In the park. He has a long stick with a nail in it. <laughs> Must have had lousy luck. <laughs> Who is that? Where? Over there, over there. The most beautiful girl I've ever seen. Wow. That's Sidney Carson. Just your type, Mr. Mozzarella. It's not what she knows, it's who she knows. And besides, she's loaded. I, 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 I'd sure like to meet her. 
Well, you've got about 12 hours. She leaves for Europe tomorrow. Introduce me, introduce me. Oh. Listen, you've got ambition, drive, very quick mind. Tell her who you are. Oh, but I'm nobody. Do you think she digs simplicity? The kind Howard Hughes has got. <laughs> you've got to help me. What'll I do? What advice can you give me? Don't be yourself. <laughs> Sydney Carson, how are you? Well, hello. Boy, it's been a long time. You look marvelous. I was so surprised to see you. I thought you'd gone to Europe. Well, no, I don't leave until tomorrow. Well, I'm glad I caught you. Isn't this something? You know this is awful, but I've forgotten your name. Oh, one up on you. I haven't forgotten your name. <laughs> Will you guys excuse us? Sydney and I won't be seeing each other for quite a while. He's still holding my hand. I know, just like old times. Marky, two martinis, very dry. <laughs> Make that three. Who is this guy? An old friend who likes holding my hand. <laughs> Haven't I seen you before, around EIU? Uh, yes, yes, that's quite possible. I, I, I work there. This morning, as a matter of fact, in the mail room. Do you work in the mail room? <laughs> That's very funny. I can't wait to tell him that back at the executive dining room. I, I was in the mailroom this morning. I was, uh, I was sending a telegram to our London office. <laughs> oh? I'm George Bender, Chemical Chemco. How do you do? I'm... I'm... I'm Dick Donaldson. Dick Donaldson? The Dick Donaldson of New Projects Division? Yeah, yeah, right. That's me. The Wonder Boy. Oh, I've heard of you. My Uncle Paul Grayson works at EIU, and he talks about you all the time. But I don't remember meeting you before. Oh, you you probably just don't remember. When I first met you, uh, I was just nobody. I can't tell you what a thrill it is meeting you, Mr. Mr. Donaldson. <laughs> oh, please, please. Call me Dick. <laughs> sure the guy crashed the party. He must still be here. Let's find him. Well, I've got to be leaving. I, I, I get to bed early. Even Wonder Boys need their sleep, you know. I was hoping we'd have a chance to talk. I'll call you in Europe. What's your number? I'll be on the Contessa del Cecchio's yacht in the Mediterranean. Oh, yes, yes. I know that number. <laughs> Bonsoir. Arrivederci. Ta-ta. See you soon. See. I saw that kid. I know right where he is. <laughs> Yoo-hoo. Good night, Cinderella. <laughs> What's this? What's this? What's this? What's this? A meeting of the little minds? Caught in some little overthrow of the mail department? Well, there is one thing you guys have got to learn. Don't think. <laughs> all right, all right, get your baskets and on the way. And when the beeper sounds, you get back here on the double. Don't make me call you twice. Now then, are the beepers working? Oh, yes, sir. Good. Let's uh, check them. Thing out of my ear. Now on your way, and don't make me call you twice. Do you understand? Yes, Mr. Coyne. Go. Oh, right, Mr. Coyne. Mr. Donaldson? Hi, oh, Mr. Donaldson. I thought it was you. How are you? You know, it's so nice to see you again. Uh, well, Sidney Carson, what are you doing here? I, I, I thought you were I thought you were leaving for Europe. Well, I am, uh, this afternoon. I just stopped to say goodbye to my uncle, Mr. Grayson. Oh, I see. Uh, this young lad has just started to work here in the mail room, and I was sort of showing him around. What was your name again, son? Uh, Arnold. Arnold, that's right. Arnold. Arnold Katz, right? Right, Katz. <laughs> Arnold Katz, Sidney Carson. How do you do? Hi. I've taken sort of a special interest in this lad. I used to work in the mailroom myself, you see. Not so long ago, right, Arnold? Seems like yesterday. <laughs> Seems like today, as a matter of fact. <laughs> yes, that's right. Uh, you're going to see your uncle. Uh, well, I won't keep you. Oh, that'll just take a second. Then I'd like to see your office. What number is it? Yeah. Why, well, uh, it's uh, number 2236. Fine. I'll see you in 15 minutes. She'll, uh... Be in my office in 15 minutes. <laughs>